Welcome back, it's time for a quick power bank test. This one was sent in via Easy ACC. It's one of the more affordable ones in their range, so we'll just unbox it, show you what's included inside. Here's the included user guide, which just goes through some of the specifications and operation, which I'll go through in a little bit more detail shortly. You have two Type A to Micro USB cables included, and this is the power bank itself, as it's a 20,000 milliamp hour bit of weight to this, two micro USB inputs on the side so that should improve the charging speed and you have four type A outputs as well as an LED light. We'll do a little test on that later on as well and there's your power switch on the side. Overall build feels fine, quite decent plastics on this, it does feel quite solid and on the underside again just covers the specifications and the potential outputs weight on this came in at around 482 grams and the reason for the extra weight is the 18650 cells in this some power banks use the lithium polymer batteries such as the Xiaomi one that I'm showing you here so it's slimmer longer and wider and that's the reason why there's a difference between these two power banks if you want to activate the torch just a double press on the side switch will turn it on and then a double press again will turn it off you've also got your four stage power level indicator on the side and you can also turn off the power bank if you do a long press. Now onto a quick test using the two charging ports and then a single charging port. So you're getting just under 3 amps in total out of this with both connected. And then once I take one of them out, you'll notice that the single port does increase very slightly. So here's your charge capacity, just over the 20,000 and it took 13.5 hours with a single USB port. And that was reduced to 6.5 with both and here's the discharge capacity 13,296 this is a single port discharge so that's the best case scenario also attached quite a few devices just to see how much I could get out of it in terms of the output and you're getting around 1.2 amps per port if you're using all of the ports at the same time here's a quick look at the LED light that's included on there and it's quite a cool tint to this but it has a fairly decent output it's one of the better ones that I've seen on a built-in power bank it's certainly going to be bright enough you could use it in an emergency you'd be able to see what you were doing or possibly something like a car repair only real drawback to this power bank is that you don't have any quick charge either input or output so if that's important do bear that in mind otherwise though it did a decent job in terms of the discharge capacity and that built-in light is also something which could be quite useful